Okay guys, I haven't vlogged in about a week? Yeah, about a week now. So there's a lot I have to catch up. So this video is going to be long. Sorry guys, I've just been busy. I just haven't been keeping up with my vlogs. I've, I've just been straight up lazy because every time I get off work, I just want to relax. I just want to sleep. I want to nap. Just relax. Okay, so... For the past week, we've been working less and less hours, and we have gotten into what's called our mega shift. Our mega shift is basically everyone from all three shifts, A, B, and C, they come together and we all work together. We work, you know, 16 hours, the max we can work is 16 hours together. Pit shops will be open 6 a.m. to 10 p.m., okay? So between those hours, we're working. Between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m., we are off the clock. We should be sleeping. We should be resting. We should not be working at all. And so, last week, as you saw in my earlier videos that, about my recruits and my friends leaving, ECUC has been sending people home like crazy. Every two days, they were sending people in big groups home, which is kind of dumb because we sell... We still have fish here, and we need as much people as we can to process all the fish that's left here at Ecook. The season is dying down, though. That's great. The season is dying down. For the past couple of days, since I want to say, see, today is Wednesday. I want to say Monday. About Monday, Tuesday, we've been working less hours. We've been working like less than eight hours. I mean, the first week, once they start sending people home, we would work a solid eight hours, nine hour days. You know, the first week, or the first couple of days of last week, I tried to um, average about 12 hours. You know, clock in at 8, get out at 8 again, or maybe 10, or maybe 11. You know, just try to get some good hours. But then once the um, people started going, more people started going home, I would average about, you know, 8 hours again. Then it would drop down to 5, 4, 3, like today. Today, I went to work at 10. 10 a.m. and we and I clocked out at 1 p.m. So about three hours of work today. Yesterday we clocked in at 8 a.m. and we got out just before lunch, so at 12, so four hours. The season is dying, like I said, the season is dead. The fishes are gone. Well, some of them are still swimming out there in the bay, but you know. Technically, it's dead because, from what I've heard, there are about 10 fishermen here at E Cook. And tomorrow, I'm gonna show you the trucks outside. I parked outside the fish house. There are so many trucks outside that all the fishermen are gone. That's what it means. If you see trucks parked outside, like I said in my earlier videos, fishermen are gone. They're going home. They're done. So, there's about maybe 10, maybe less than 10 fishermen left here still pulling up some fish and giving us work which is what we want but at the same time since, since we've been working less and less hours we just want to you know kind of relax a bit and just get over with get oh get season over with because once season ends we have about two to three days worth of cleanup which means that we dismantle all the belts from the machine we dismantle dismantle all the um you know the belts the machines the um the converters everything everything we dismantle everything we clean it we do deep cleaning Last year, that's what I did last year. Last year, we had basically two crews working, working, the, working and cleaning the machines like crazy. Now this year, there's about maybe, oh my gosh, thirty people, about thirty people, maybe forty people left here at camp. And compared to last year, we had about maybe sixty. I want to say sixty, fifty people, which is enough to clean. But this year, um. There's going to be less and less people cleaning the camp. Cleaning out the, the camp and the fish house. And the case up and everything. In between. Okay, so what else do I talk about? Um, People left. Season ending. And, oh yeah. Very topic of this talk. Petersburg. So, I just found out today that this Friday, the 28th. 28th or 29th? Yeah, 28th, this Friday, I get to go to Petersburg again, round three. 
It's going to be great. I mean, from what I've heard, Petersburg, they went in Petersburg, they're working 18 hour days, 16 to 18 hour days in Petersburg, which is super duper crazy, but it's what we came up here to do, to work, make money. And like the saying goes out here, no money, no honey. <laughs> and so, yeah, so I was asleep here in my bed. Oh, and Brandon, my friend, knocked on my door, told me we're going to Petersburg, it's Friday. They put the list, it's on the board. And so I went to go check it out, and my name was on it. Everyone who was going to Petersburg was on it. And so this Friday we leave. Tomorrow, we work, sadly. We don't know why we work, but we work. And then after that, we pack our things, which is, which is what I'm going to do in a little bit. I'm pack up all of my clothes. That way, I, I could get it over with and not worry about it tomorrow. That's pretty much what's been happening in the past week. People are going home like crazy. We've gotten to our mega shifts, and we have um, are getting ready to go to Petersburg. Those who are not going to Petersburg are staying here to clean up. Rumor has it that there are still fish coming. Not a lot, not in big numbers, not like, not like before, but they're still coming. And we don't know how they're going to do it because pretty much all the headers but one are going to Petersburg. They're most likely going to one, run one line. Who knows what they're going to do about it. But I mean, we don't care because we're going to Petersburg. We're going to go to Petersburg, hopefully get there at night time, go to the bar, drink up, get messed up because we totally deserve this like you guys don't even know oh my gosh like this season has been hectic for all of us it's taking a toll on all of us it's taking a huge toll on all of us including me and so which i'll talk about the hardships here working at ecook in my next video okay i have time right now i have time i'm trying to catch up on my vlogs trying to catch up on my videos so that you guys know how it is up here okay so i'm gonna end this video right here and so I can talk about the hardships here in ECOOK. Alright? This is Yavin, clocking out.